So what is the most dangerous thing you can think of in Minecraft? You might say the Ender Dragon, you might say the Wither, you might even say eating kelp for three days straight, but I tell you, there's something more dangerous than all of those things put together. And that is playing in a Minecraft world where everything is TNT. Yes, one wrong move, ladies and gentlemen. And not only will I be going sky high, but my computer will uh, completely be destroyed. So how are we going to manage in this completely TNT world, you may be wondering. Well, I have absolutely no idea. I'm going to have to start by taking out a pig. I have absolutely no tools. Um, all, only thing I do know is that we can't, we can't uh, set off any TNT. The other thing I have made sure to do is to turn off fire spreads. Otherwise, yeah, we'd already be in trouble, all right? But I don't know, you know, if a creeper blows up or lightning strikes or anything like that, everything will, will just blow up. So, yeah, this is, um, this is going to be interesting. And make sure to subscribe if you're new to the channel because uh, statistics tell me about 76% of you are not subscribed. Oh, you see, this is exactly what I was worried about. Yeah, if, if you don't want uh, my computer to blow sky high, guys, please subscribe because I'm sure you'll enjoy. You can always unsubscribe. Like, chicken, don't do it. Sorry, I missed. I missed again. <laughs> what am I? Oh, okay. All right, I didn't ask. I didn't, I didn't do that. He did that on his own, okay? If anybody asked, he did that on his own. So you may think that I'm completely crazy being in a complete TNT world and that I can't do anything, but structures will still generate. So your abandoned mine shafts, your strongholds, your villages, everything will generate with all the normal blocks. So I, I can still get wood and stuff. I just need to find an abandoned mine shaft. And caves are still a thing. And anyway, mining, well, it's a piece of cake. You just punch your way through and uh, look at that. See, there's still ores down here. Fantastic, okay? So um, <laughs> I guess the first quest will be to find an abandoned mine shaft. Although before we even contemplate that, I want to first try and find myself a village because then if I have wood, I can go and get ores and all sorts of stuff like that. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna throw away all this TNT as well. We don't uh, we don't really need it. So yeah, I mean obviously like grass and flowers can't actually stay on TNT. So if I like I don't know, let's let's just say I update the block, this will break. See, it'll just disappear. So that's why it's just seedlings everywhere and and, and all that because they can't they can't stay on uh, <laughs> on TNT. Believe it or not, grass does not actually grow on TNT, but. For those that haven't updated, they're still, they're still there and kicking. So, we are in a, an acacia biome. You can tell from the uh, the acacia TNT trees. Can we find a village? That remains to be seen. 12 seconds later. We have found a village. Okay, brilliant. Alrighty, perfect, perfect stuff. Okay, you see, it's part of TNT, as you can see. So, okay, that's good stuff. So, yeah, as I was saying, you know, if anything goes wrong, a creeper blows up or... I don't know, there could be some redstone somewhere that I accidentally trigger... You know, like jungle temples, desert temples. I, I don't know. I mean, I've, I've even got to be careful in this village, I suppose, to make sure that I don't do anything that could trigger it. Because, because yeah. <laughs> if, uh, if if any TNT blows up, guys, the video will most definitely end along with my PC completely crashing. So, hello. Hello, fellas. Um, I am just in search of a furnace, really. Because I don't really know any other way to get cobblestone, unless I didn't make like some sort of cobblestone generator. All right, let's uh, let's search this uh, this village. Okay, we got slabs in it. So like wood, not a problem. You can see we can, we can make wood, so we can make a crafting table. But cobblestone, oh, wait, is it? No, it's, okay, this this was once a, a proud uh, <laughs> cobblestone well. Now it's a TNT well. Oh, this, I did, it looks cool though. I'll give you that. Oh, we've got farmland, dirt. It's great to see dirt. I can get oh, brilliant. Don't know what I'll do with it. Oh, food as well. Probably a good thing. Don't mind me, guys. I'm just gonna. Steal your crops. I was very hopeful that I'd find a blacksmith this one. It doesn't seem to be the case. We're now going to have to very monotonously mine up all of this, uh, these planks, which shouldn't take me too long at all, should it? So let's, uh, let's go and do this. We are on 1.12. That is just because uh, the mod used to create this world is uh, is only on 1.12. So that's why we're, uh, we're doing that. So yeah, I'm going to make a crafting table and try and find some sheep and make a bed. That's that's kind of my next plan. Or even better, we can steal their wool. Ha ha. And then we should. We've got torches now as well, which is good. But if we, yeah, if we can find enough wool, we can make us up. Oh, the rain is coming. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I hope this is not a thunderstorm. Because that is the single worst thing that can happen. Oh, there's all the sheep over there. Okay. Um, yeah, if it is a thunderstorm, <laughs> one lightning strike will set everything on fire. So, yeah. I'm actually scared to leave this acacia bank. Is there no more, no more wool? No, okay. Right, let's go and get this sheep over here then, all right? Um, I should probably eat some, some potatoes or something so I'm not walking around like the world's slowest person. All right. Let's get this, and then we, we can get ready to sleep, because I feel like we're going to need to do that soon. Okay, it's just a normal rainstorm. Thank goodness for that. Running is futile, sheep. Thank you. Got some mutton as well. See, like, the rest of you can all survive. So bed completion has been successful. So now we'll uh, we'll get some shut-eye, and then in the morning, we'll, uh, <laughs> we'll hope that it's not raining anymore, basically. I might as well take these with me. Yeah. So, I mean, that's, that's a good way to dodge creepers, but can you imagine me being in caves and stuff? To be honest, if, if we actually manage to survive this entire... 
Yeah, honestly, yeah. At some point, the TNT <laughs> is going to blow up. This is, this is basically if the TNT blows up, the video ends kind of a video. Because I'll tell you what, if it does blow up, the video will most certainly end, won't it? So I'm going to get some dirt just in case I find myself needing it. I'm not really sure. Oh, there was some wool right there, wasn't it? All along. Um, yeah, I don't know if I actually will need it, but just in case, I'm, uh, I'm going to get it. Okay, guys, I, I found a crafting table after all. <laughs> was in, I didn't even need to, uh, to mine all that extra wood. Um... Yeah, I guess I should, to be honest, speaking of that, I should uh, probably work on getting some tools together. My, my, my thinking was maybe if I could find myself a, um, a villager that would trade tools for me, but I can't seem to find one either. I need, I need a, a blacksmith, I think. But uh, yeah, so far, well, a toolsmith, but the, I haven't seen it. They're all just clerics, all of them, every single one, <laughs> which I don't have much, uh, much use for them. So we'll go and make ourselves uh, an axe, and then we'll make, look at that. We're going to be doing some speedy stuff now, and then we'll go and make a, uh, a pickaxe as well. Pickaxe has also been achieved, so that will allow me to get coal. Yeah, getting cobblestone is going to be another another issue. Let's put this in the offhand as well. There we go. So I'm going to carry on in search of, of more structures. I'm sure we'll be able to find some stuff because um, obviously wooden tools, you know, are nice for now, but we don't want them forever. If we could find maybe, yeah, good, hmm, I don't know. We need to find we need to find something. That's all I know. <laughs> something must be located. And we have a cave here. You never know. Oh, iron. Wait, can we actually mine iron with this? <laughs> Get ready for disaster, guys. I'm pretty sure you can't. You know, I'm 99% sure. I'm 100% sure you can't. If this, if I don't, what did I tell you? I knew it. Yep. Yeah, okay. Nothing down here. Pretty useless cave. Let's uh, search elsewhere. To be honest, the main way I see myself getting cobblestone is by making a cobblestone generator, which means we're going to need lava and water. So this is a pretty good place, but we need iron, and obviously to get iron, we need cobblestone. This does add an extra level, extra level of uh, difficulty to Minecraft, doesn't it? Instead of just being simple, you know. Get wood, get cobblestone, get iron, get diamonds. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Don't get cobblestone, because that does never happen in uh, in a month of Sundays. Okay, look what we have here, ladies and gentlemen. Cobblestone. What did I say? Never happens in a month of Sundays. Well, on this Sunday, it has happened. Now then. Pretty sure I can just build with TNT, can't I? Yeah, look at this. Okay. So we've got to try and get to this cobblestone. And then we, we can... Yeah, we've kind of got a, a ready-made cobblestone generator. Eh? I was thinking, what if I patched that up like this... Yeah, it's going to create more cobblestone for me. Which is just what we what the doctor ordered. Okay, well, that's about all it, it's going to do. What if we uh, go like this? Ta -da! There we go. Perfect. Okay, so we've got loads more cobblestone now. Um, so enough to make a cobblestone pickaxe, a stone pickaxe, which is then going to allow me to make a cobblestone generator because I'll be able to get iron. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, so this is purely for scientific purposes, but I'm not going to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. What on earth? What? I was right by water, but couldn't swim to it. And I, okay, I was about to say, <laughs> I'll go and get my stuff back. I don't think it all went in the lava, but purely for scientific purposes, I've not slept. <laughs> At least I wish I had now, because um, I, I wanted to see if any mobs spawn, and it seems that mobs cannot spawn on TNT blocks, which is absolutely fantastic. Um, the the bad news is, yeah, I'm gonna go and have to find my stuff. I know pretty much where I, I should go though, so I, sh I reckon I can find it pretty quickly, but yeah, I can't, I can't believe that, I was like pulling me in for some reason, that was uh, that was super weird. Okay guys, so I've found the village that I was in before, so I've got to remake all my tools now, I've got a bit more food, hopefully my stuff still hasn't despawned, but I thought I might as well, yeah, make some tools, and then carry on uh, in search of my stuff. If I don't find my stuff, I've just got to, if I can find that place where there's water and lava together for my cobblestone, then that's that's all I really need for, uh, for it to be perfect. Can you not place... No, you can't move. I didn't know that. What if we uh, turn this to that? There we go, sir. You have a door. Yeah, so I just need to um, get more wood and then find all my stuff. I've got another crafting table here for me, which is good. But I didn't bring enough wood last time anyway. So, um, yeah, I'll make me tools and then <laughs> hopefully find me stuff. To be honest, guys, I, I do feel quite lost, but there's a giant lava thing over there, which is not the same one. But if I can try and find some water nearby there, it might be a good source of cobblestone. Otherwise, I think my best bet is just to go to bedrock or something and because and, you usually find water and and lava quite close to each other there yeah i don't hmm, i don't know could i let's have a little thing I, I could probably connect them up actually like yeah if i made a a water a, a lava yeah okay i've got a plan guys this is quite an audacious effort but i'm gonna try and like make a lava you'll see what i'm, I'm thinking okay so i want lava to flow like this yeah so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna make a little lava tunnel and i want that to reach all the way to the water that is over here. So I've created a tunnel, and I guess I could make a bit of a cobblestone generator of sorts, couldn't I? If I, uh, hmm, 
Yeah, I'm not sure exactly how I would best do this, but yeah, if I just have it come down a bit lower and then... Yeah, this could work, guys. A, a cobblestone generator. I'll be honest with you, guys. This is like no cobblestone generator the world has ever seen. Look at it. It works as well. It works a treat. So, all I have to do now is mine cobblestone. Beautiful. Okay. It. Yeah, I mean, it's foolproof. Okay, all we have to do, yeah, if we put a bit of that there, maybe. No, actually, that's not a good idea. Uh, if we put a bit on there, maybe. And then that'll just stop me from floating into the lava. Beautiful. Alrighty, so I'll just collect up all the cobblestone I need. This is better than before. We've we've really taken strides of progress. So I managed to get about 20 cobblestone, which is perfect for everything that I'm going to need. So um, we're also going to need a furnace. So let's go and grab a furnace. I'm going to need a stone pickaxe. Perfect. Oh, look at this. We can get cooking now as well. You want baked potatoes for a change? Don't you worry. And <laughs> there's plenty more where that came from. Coal galore. I'm, I'm, I'm really proud of myself. Can you tell? <laughs> I've never been so proud of myself in Minecraft before. This is absolutely fantastic. We can actually make another furnace. Look at this. We're creating an empire down here. The only issue is, do I have enough wood? I mean, I've got 30 pieces of wood, so I guess for now, that's good. I should probably stick to getting sticks from dead bushes. Might be a, uh, a safer way to do things. I don't actually have anything to go in there anymore, so I <laughs> don't know what that was all about. Uh, okay, it is dark, but... Hmm. See, this is my other plan. My other plan is, do I build a platform for mobs to spawn on? <laughs> That's a stupid idea. That's a dangerous idea. But you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to I'm gonna get a uh, thing. I'm going to build a mob spawning platform, okay? We're just going to need a load more cobblestone. If we get, like, I don't know, 30 cobblestone, and then we'll we'll create a platform for spawning uh, whatever we need. Right, I am armed with 32 pieces of cobblestone. I think it would be a good idea to build it out in the uh, in the middle of a water thing, you know, just so that it's it's well out of the way of everybody else. I mean, they'd have to swim to get to me, but I reckon we might get quite a few mobs spawned on here, so we've got to be prepared for that, all right? If, it, if there's going to be creepers, disaster could happen <laughs> if I allow it to. So I'm just going to, yeah, create a nice little platform if I can actually build properly. Uh, safe as houses, and then I'll, I'll walk away a bit, come back, and see what we've got spawned. Oh ho! It worked! Okay, that was not the mob I heard. So one spawned somewhere else, I don't know where, but we have ourselves. There must be something underneath me then, as well, that can spawn. So, I don't know, some structure of some description? Alright, mate. This is just to prove a point, that my spawning platform works well, okay? So, oh, I've got, uh, you know, I'm not going to go for that iron. You know, iron's not exactly hard to find, but I'm guessing if I go, like, kind of, yeah, down like this, hmm, there's a better way to do it. But if I, like, yeah, dig down, I might be able to find myself some sort of cave. I mean, we've already found a uh, some iron so we'll go we'll go a bit of exploring see if we can find a, a cave or, or some mine shaft something like that okay we're, we found a cave all right we're in now then anything could be in here but if we allow a creeper to blow up it's curtains okay because i'm pretty sure on ores they could they could probably spawn i reckon for mobs that's my guess anyway so i'm gonna go and grab this i'm gonna make a few more torches so we can light things up okay put those in me offhand okay um yeah Okay, here's... Oh, okay. So he must have spawned on the ores, maybe? Uh, I'm guessing. So we're going to go and um, have to deal with this skeleton. I'm going to need more iron. I, I don't know. Did I bring any... I didn't bring any cobblestone, so I can't actually make a furnace while I'm down here. It'd probably be a good idea for, for me to go back and get a furnace or something like that so I can get my armor sorted. Good idea. Let's let's do that. Uh, so it must be here, yeah, that we need to go down here and collect more cobblestone. Or we could just nick one of these furnaces since, you know, I'm not even using this one. <laughs> That'd be a good idea, but... I'll bring a bit of extra cobblestone for good measure. So where were we? Let's uh, let's go and place a furnace right about here. We'll go and uh, raw beef. Okay, I don't want, I don't need raw beef. Let's think of the priorities here. Okay, so that's going to be smelting. Let's have a little look. Anything? Yeah. So we have. We can hear water. Ooh. Very interesting indeed. It, it, does it just go to a dead end? Looks like it might. Do. I should probably grab this iron though, since uh, we're still working on getting full armor. Once we got full armor. We can we can breathe easy, okay? But until that point, we need to uh, we need to work hard. Turns out that this down here does go further as well. Look how low it goes. Oh, this could be the prime place for diamonds. Also, oh, okay. This is perfect. This is redstone lava. Fantastic stuff. This okay? And not a not a mob to be seen. But I need to go back and get my furnace. Okay, I'm not, not leaving that behind because I don't have many of those to spare. Okay, this I've just uncovered another room and it's an abandoned mine shaft. Oh, perfect. Okay, and you can see all of that, although there's still a wood. So there is chances of things spawning. Okay, let's... Oh, man, there's going to be some serious exploration to be had here. Can we find a mob? Can we... We've got to be careful, because, like I say, there is potential 
for things like creepers to spawn. All right, and if that happens, <laughs> it will be it will be all over for me. I see mobs over there spawning. So yeah, we've got to be so so careful. Okay, so all my iron is now smelted. I'll put my raw beef that can be cooking. So we just need, I think, a helmet, and then I've got full armor. Let's go and make ourselves a fresh sword as well, just for a bit of extra. Can we do that right? There we go. Extra power. Perfect. All right, we are now ready and armed. Just need my food. I'm gonna quickly grab some iron from here because I'd also like to make a bucket. So let's grab uh, a couple of these. A few, yeah. So because I have got one iron left, but obviously we need three iron to make a bucket and well, a bit of extra iron for good measure. So I can now craft myself a bucket, perfect, and we will just wait for this bit of iron, final bit of iron to smell, and then we shall be on our way, because I think we'll, we'll have everything we uh, we need, so let's grab all this, there's all sorts of mob noises coming from the area, but we'll grab that, we'll grab the craft table, leave nothing behind, I always say, apart from a torch, that's not a problem, and then we'll go back this way, we'll check out this, this mining system, um, there is water about, which is good, right, let's swap that out, let's eat, start eating steak, why not, eat the good stuff now, <laughs> We've upgraded in life. We've actually got somewhere in this on this. Um, so yeah, we can go this way. And that just gives me lava, which, yeah, you know what? We're going to go the other way. We can go where these... We'll grab this water. Okay, have we actually got the water? Yeah. <laughs> I was a bit glitched. Okay, so the quest to find diamonds begins. Now, to be honest, like, I bet strip mining is super easy on this because you can mine so quickly. But we're going to try and just do it through exploring. I'm... Yeah, I'm not sure if we can somehow accidentally light the TNT. If fire spreads was on, then we definitely would. But because fire spreads is off, we're all right. I did see the gold back there, but I'm not too bothered about gold. Although, it keeps tempting me with the gold. So, if we just go like this. This is completely safe, isn't it? It's just like normal Minecraft, all right? But there's TNT everywhere and one wrong move. And uh, <laughs> disaster will strike, to put it simply. Disaster will strike. I, I found them. I found diamonds. Brilliant. Didn't think I had it. I thought, oh, what's this here? Now, I, I was just going to say, the thing I have got to be careful of is I'm creating obsidian and mobs can spawn an obsidian. But, well, we found diamonds. Brilliant stuff. Okay. Well, what is what is the next step on the agenda? You know what I think? I wasn't I wasn't sure whether to do this, but I think I'm going to go to the nether. I think, I think I'm just going to go for it. I mean, I know it has its risks, but think of the benefits. See, things like this, this is where it's, it's just not a good idea. <laughs> mobs can spawn. The problem is with the nether. Is the nether's going to be all TNT? <gasps> oh, no. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, see you later. You not Don't go through there, all right? This <laughs> Oh, my goodness. If he accidentally blows up. <gasps> oh, no, this is the one. <laughs> I told you it was a bad idea. Great, I'm Wait, is it the same creeper? I'd have no idea. Okay, we just need to get out of it. No need to panic, okay? We don't need to go back the same way. We just need to get the heck out of here. Otherwise, yeah, we're in, we're in big trouble. So... Let's let's go and make ourselves. Why oh, you're a witch now? Oh man! Oh, you're there. Okay. What is well these all these mobs spawning? I don't know. I just want some peace and quiet. Have we got peace and quiet now? I think we have. Okay. So, time to formulate a plan. Let's go and make ourselves. We've got eight diamonds. That's like the best amount of all you can find in vein, isn't it? We're gonna go and make ourselves a pickaxe. Let's make some more sticks. Okay. Diamond pick. And I'm also gonna make get a bucket of lava. I think that probably makes sense. So we'll go like that. We'll go. Yes, yeah, so we'll get a bucket. And then we'll make a portal using, I think we'll do it using buckets rather than mining it, just because it's, it's 10 times quicker. Um, are we going to have to make it through this? Yeah, look at this, ready? <sighs> Too slow. You snooze, you lose. Right, is there any creepers around here? Okay. You know what? No, I, I, don't, I, don't, I, I can't risk it. I can't risk it. <laughs> it's just too risky. Oh, man. Can I do it? Oh, can I do it? Can I do it? Oh, this is the most terrifying thing I've ever done. Don't blow up. Oh my goodness. Okay, okay, we did it. Creeper exterminated. Brilliant. Okay. And this creeper's galore down there. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Oh man. I'm so gonna die. Oh man. Okay, you know what? We just gotta go back this way. I just heard something happen to that creeper. I don't know what happened. We've got to find, we're going to have to find some lava elsewhere because, <laughs> yeah, this, 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 this is not a good way to go. Okay, still you here. Let's try and get rid of you before you poison me. I got rid of you. Perfect. Ooh, we've got redstone and uh, a potion of healing. How very helpful indeed. Yeah. I can hear lava. So let's, let's just try and mine for some lava and, and do it that way. Okay, I've come through to this. This looks like a good little, uh, little spot if you ask me. So I'm going to spend some time just bringing this up. There we go. Beautiful. Okay. So I just want to create, yeah. So nothing can sneak up on me. 
I mean, I just battled a creeper with TNT absolutely everywhere. I mean, it doesn't get much more terrifying than that. So now we can create a nice little little room. I mean, look at the speed we can mine at. Beautiful stuff. Okay, and uh, oh, okay. still got to be careful though. <laughs> and now we'll create a little uh, place for a portal. You know, as I'm building this portal, I've just realized I have absolutely no way to light this portal. And there's no gravel anywhere. Um, yeah, didn't think this through. You know, guys, I'm going to build the portal. I'm, I'm not entirely sure if I'm going to be able to pull this off or not. But I'm going to try and use wood. I'm not sure if the wood sets on fire or not. But I think it does, you know. And I think I might be able to use that to light it. So, yeah, this could go wrong, though, if I accidentally light the TNT on fire. That's, <laughs> that's my only uh, worry at this point. So even though, yeah, fire spread is off, I'm not sure how that affects everything. So let's just go and grab this. Okay. Okay, this is what I've come up with. You, you know when you just know something's not going to work? Well, this is one of those situations where it's like, <laughs> without fire spread, this is never going to light on fire, is it? But if it does, it'll light the portal. But I, I, I mean, I can't think of any way to get flint, you see. Um, because I can't get gravel. And I don't know what, what mop does it. But yeah, I don't think I don't think this is going to light on fire no matter what happens. So it looks like going to the nether is just, it's just not possible. Okay, guys, this is clearly not working. So I have one of two options. I can uh, give up or I can <laughs> illegally give myself flint and steel. Which one do you think I'm going to do? Yep, that is correct. I'm going to illegally give myself flint and steel and light this. And and to be honest, I think I'm going to crash my game when I go to the nether. Honestly, the video could well end once I go to the nether because I think, yeah, I think it's going to break everything. But it's all right. <laughs> I'm really worried. <laughs> but I think, yeah, because it's... Okay, okay. Here we go. We're in the nether. It's not broken, but there's, there's blaze everywhere. And I'm pretty sure if a blaze hits TNT... Oh my goodness, wait, they did over there. It's not blowing up. Are they hitting it? Wait, it's setting on fire, but... Oh, I thought it would actually... Well, that's handy. Don't nicely, uh, don't nicely blow it up. I mean, I know TNT explodes are on, but for some reason, I thought blaze would light on fire. Like, TNT can be on fire in this, and it's all right. Well, <laughs> creepers are my only worry. To be honest, yeah, I, I don't know why I'm even here. Um, I just wanted to... To prove a point. I mean, it's blaze everywhere. So let's just get rid of you. Come on, get out of here, you. Brilliant stuff. Um, I think I think yeah, I'm probably just gonna go up. Look at this. <laughs> it's carnage. I thought, yeah, the moment they, they did this, it, but we're alright. All is well that ends well. Of course, SB being SB manages to die in the uh, in the nether, which is always great. And I'm now back at spawn. Yeah, um, that's just great. I definitely have the potential to go back to the nether and get my stuff back and carry on, but honestly, we've been, uh, we've, this video is long enough. We all just want to see one thing, don't we? Yes! Ha ha ha!